my name is George Salcedo. I work for Ruder Hero Plumbing. Today we're going to go over removing the toilet and cabling through closet vents. Uh, first thing when removing the toilet, you want to shut off the supply, the water supply to the toilet uh, on the angle stop here. Once your water is off, go ahead and flush your toilet to make sure that all the water in the tank is completely out, which will make it a lot easier to move the toilet. Once you do that, remove your supply line. Once you remove your supply line, go ahead and remove your closet flange bolts here. You can remove the bolts using either channel locks or a 716 key. Before removing the toilet, you want to remove the tank cover uh, just to protect it and from breaking or causing any, any damage anywhere else. When you remove the toilet, you want to completely take it out and you want to set it on top of a bin to protect the customer's house and protect the toilet as well. Um, you want to grab it from the base here. You want to tilt it back left and right, depending if there's caulking in there, it might be a little difficult. Once that's out, you can go ahead and pull it. And after you remove your toilet and you have your machine safely on a mat or a drop cloth, you can begin a cable to the closet bin. And that's how you remove a toilet and cable to the closet bin. <laughs>